Welcome to Time of Death. This video is for informational purposes only and in no way meant to glorify or condone violence. In today's video, we'll be discussing the murder of Walter Hernandez. Hernandez was shot multiple times at 5.20 p.m. on Monday, September 10, 2007. The shooting happened on the 1500 block of East 42nd Street in the Central Alameda area just south of downtown LA. Rafael Salas was subsequently arrested and charged with the murder. The following is the evidence at trial. On September 10, 2007, Walter Hernandez was with his girlfriend and his longtime friend, CP, at CP's home, located in 38th Street Gang Territory in LA. Hernandez was a member of 38th Street with prominent gang tattoos, including a 38 on his head. As the three were socializing outside, a black Lincoln Navigator, a white four-door sedan, and a silver Toyota Camry drove down the street. The Navigator stopped, and CP thought the cars looked suspicious and asked Hernandez who was in the Navigator, but Hernandez didn't answer. Hernandez was sitting on his bike, arguing on the phone. As the Navigator drove away, CP told Hernandez to be careful. Hernandez rode away on his bike and replied, I'll be back, let me check it out. As Hernandez turned his bicycle in the direction of the Navigator, the white sedan drove towards him and stopped. The defendant, Rafael Salas, stepped out of the car with a black handgun, which he cocked. He walked swiftly towards Hernandez, shooting four or five times. Hernandez was hit several times in his torso and once in the back of the head at very close range. The defendant ran back to the white car and CP rushed to Hernandez and called 911. He gave the emergency operator a partial license plate for the white sedan. 4H7E. When the police arrived, Hernandez was laying on the street receiving treatment from emergency responders. He was alive but unconscious. He died later at the hospital. Detective Miguel Terrazas was assigned to the investigation the following day. He tracked down a video recording from an intersection near the shooting and found footage of the three cars described in the police reports. The white car was a 1999 Buick Regal. There was no match in the DMV database for the partial license plate provided by CP of 4H7E, but there was a match for 4HZE, a 1999 Buick Regal registered to Rafael Salas. The defendant was spotted in his car by police on October 23, 2007 and was arrested. CP was unable to identify the defendant at the preliminary hearing because his appearance had changed. The trial court granted the prosecution's motion to have the defendant's head shaved for trial, and CP was able to identify him at trial. Another witness also identified the defendant. Officer Gilberto Rendon testified as a gang expert. He testified that the defendant is a member of the Florencia 13th Street Gang. Based on his association with known gang members, his appearance on the gang roster confiscated from jail, identifying him as a Florencia 13th member with the moniker Gunner. 38th Street and Florencia are rivals. The killing of Hernandez was done for the benefit of the gang. Following the trial, the jury convicted Rafael Salas of murder, including the gun and gang enhancements. He was sentenced to life in prison without the possibility of parole. Walter Hernandez was 23 years old at the time of death. 